this gorgeous little pond and wetland area here in Hookman along the Kennedy River in Clayoquot First Nation Territory has been created over the past couple years thanks to some hardworking and industrious beavers. As ecosystem engineers, beavers create their own optimal habitat by gnawing up and felling trees, which they then use to dam and slow the flow of water so that more of their food sources grow in these wetted areas, which consist of deciduous plants and trees like willows, maples, and cottonwoods on whose shoots they feed on year round. Yet these ponds end up playing a really important role in these ecosystems beyond just the immediate needs of the beavers by providing freshwater habitat for all sorts of amphibians and fish like salmon, while also retaining moisture during the summer months to reduce the impact of drought and fires and mitigating the impacts of floods. Ponds like this are absolutely amazing and we should have more of them, but unfortunately we've got a little problem here because this one is right along a highway and by damming up the culverts that flow underneath it, they end up creating a lot of damage that results in flooding and blocking this one road in and out of a small community. Now back before us silly humans realized how important beavers were to these ecosystems, people probably just would have come in here and torn down their dams and then killed them for their pelts. But thankfully, we've wised up. And here at Redfish, we're developing some better alternatives. So after carefully removing a dam from within one of the culverts, we installed beaver guards around the mouths of these culverts, which consists of heavy metal grating that allows for water to pass through while creating a buffer around the actual drain. The gaps in this grating is also big enough for fish to pass through at all stages of life, so they can continue to utilize and benefit from the amazing habitat and complex floodplain that these beavers are contributing to. These guards will still allow beavers to stack wood, to build their dams, to slow the flow of water, and create their gorgeous ponds that benefit so many, but without jamming up the culverts themselves and still allowing for fish and a minimum amount of water to pass through as to maintain the infrastructure of the highway. See, us human people are just as much a part of these ecosystems as all these non-human people that we share them with, from the beavers, to the trees they eat, to the fish who benefit, and it's time that we recognize that, to change our approach on these landscapes in ways that allows for all of us to thrive. And finding unique ways like this to work alongside these beavers instead of working against them is crucial in creating healthy watersheds and healthy futures for all of us.